Hi there and welcome back. Dan again from Clean Guru. From your biggest five, seven day a week cleaning job that you have, your biggest account, down to maybe your smallest, maybe a one day a week account. If they're with you, if they're one of your customers and they're profitable, you want them to be happy and to stay with you. And we talked about how people don't necessarily appreciate what you do, they appreciate what they notice and so we talked about noticeable cleaning as a way of keeping all of our customers what about your people what about all of your employees your staff from the person who maybe is your route supervisor or site supervisor or your area manager to maybe someone who's just a part-time person who cleans one account for you possibly just like your biggest and smallest customers you want to keep all of your employees. You work so hard to get them, especially today, to get and keep good people. So how do we keep the people? Well, in the same way that we keep our customers, the selling, the selling is not over once we land the account. The selling to our people to be with us, to stay with us, is not over once we fill in the you know, once we fill out their starting papers and get them going. And as you know, it's not enough to say, well, we treat everyone fairly and we pay more than minimum wage. You know, that ship has sailed, right? People want to be appreciated. So possibly we can develop some specific ideas around the idea of not noticeable cleaning, but noticeable appreciation. So what could that look like? Things that your employees could notice and therefore appreciate. Well, first of all, beyond just pay, you know, paying them fairly and treating them fairly, how about something like getting to really know them? Getting to really know them, visit with them. That makes a big deal. People really appreciate that personal connection. Um, number two, how about working out with them a schedule that really fits their life. And by the way, if we really get to know them, it may help us to figure out a schedule that not only helps our company, but also the schedule helps their life. It fits in with their life. And then the third thing is to appreciate our employees. Do we have built-in recognition? Whether it's, you know, maybe awards for how long they've been with us, or even just in, in, in meetings that we have, calling out and appreciating what they do. So those are just three small ideas. But noticeable appreciation may be a good strategy, especially today, to incorporate into our cleaning businesses beyond noticeable cleaning. Something to think about. Until next time, remember that you can do this. You really can.